السلام عليكم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وصحبه ومن والاه رب اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي أمري وحل عقدة من لساني يفقه قولي All praise is due to Allah, Lord and Sustainer of the Worlds. We pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we are thankful for all of his blessings. And we are especially grateful to Allah that we are a part of the ummah, the community of his beloved Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Because I believe that Everything that we need, we already have. That the prayers of our ancestors have been answered. And the trust is in our hands. Right? The trust is in our hands. And it's our time to act. And so let's look at this idea of unity. Because everybody talks about it. You know, I know I got hooked by archives and I've be unity to death. <laughs> unity, unity, unity. Right? But what I want to do today is reconnect us to the Quranic paradigm. And this is not a novel thing. My hope is to put in your mind a paradigm of unity that is possible tonight. So in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, in Surah Ali Imran, Surah 3, 3, Allah ta'ala says, وَاذْكُرُوا نِعْمَةَ اللَّهِ عَلَيْكُمْ إِذْ كُنْتُمْ أَعْدَاءً فَأَلَّفَ بَيْنَ قُلُوبِكُمْ فَأَصْبَحْتُمْ بِنِعْمَتِهِ إِخْوَانًا وَكُنْتُمْ عَلَى شَفَى حُفْرَةٍ مِنَ النَّارِ فَأَنْقَذَكُمْ مِنْهَا كَذَلِكَ يُبَيِّنُ اللَّهُ لَكُمْ آيَاتِهِ لَعَلَّكُمْ تَهْتَدُونَ وَلْتَكُمْ مِنْكُمْ أُمَّةٍ يَدْعُونَ إِلَى الْخَيْرِ وَيَأْمُرُونَ بِالْمَعْرُوفِ وَيَنْهَوْنَ عَنِ الْمُنْكَرِ وَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الْمُفْلِحُونَ ولا تكونوا كالذين تفرقوا واختلفوا من بعد ما جاءهم البينات وأولئك لهم عذاب عظيم and hold fast all together unto the bond of Allah and do not draw apart from one another and remember the blessings which Allah has bestowed upon you. How, when you were enemies, he brought your hearts together. So that through this blessing, you became brothers. And how, when you were on the brink of the fire abyss, he saved you from it. In this way, Allah makes clear his messages unto you so that you might find guidance and that there might grow out of you a community of people who invite unto all that is good and enjoy in enjoying the doing of what is right and forbid the doing of what is wrong. And it is they, they who shall attain to a happy state and be not like those who have drawn apart from one another and have taken to conflicting views after all the evidence of the truth has come to them. For these it is for whom tremendous suffering is in store. Never let anyone tell us, your history is not important, brother or sister. And we have done this. We have done this in some regards to our own detriment. See, I'm an imam, alhamdulillah, and I try not to pull any punches. 
Why? Because as all of the imams said, I like to get my hands dirty. In fact, I can't help but get my hands dirty because I have kids. <laughs> so my first umma is in my house because they all got ideas. I have four sons and two daughters and they all have, they're looking and they're searching. Right? And so we must, as Sheikh Muhammad told us, we got to reconnect. We have to. This is the yearning that's in our souls. It's the yearning that's in my soul. And when we reconnect, we will see a beautiful thing.